Well, Annalise, uh, Hans-Georg Maaßen was removed, uh, had, did have his duties as domestic intelligence chief removed, but he will now be given what is being interpreted as a promotion. He'll become deputy head of the Interior Ministry. Now, this is a state secretary job. It's a pay rise and one with which he will ultimately have more influence over domestic policies in Germany. And many MPs in Germany are not happy about this, uh, not least the Social Democrats who had been calling for Maaßen to be fired. Uh, but many other parliamentarians also outraged. One of the leaders of the Green Party said that instead of Maaßen being punished for his, um, for his disloyalty and also for, for cozying up to the Alternative for Germany party, he has been rewarded. Um, Maaßen not only criticised in recent weeks for uh, his comments about Chemnitz, but also because uh, he is alleged to have made links to the far-right Alternative for Germany party, including meeting members privately and giving them advice. This is something which adds to the scandal surrounding Maaßen, which is why many people were saying that he should have lost his job. But instead, as we see, he's been given a newer, better job. Well, Merkel's uh, decision to appoint Maaßen into the Interior Ministry is, is certainly a curious one because, uh, like Horst Seehofer, who's the Interior Minister, Hans-Georg Maaßen is also a big critic of Angela Merkel's migration policy. He will now, in the Interior Ministry, be working very closely with Seehofer on uh, carving out migration policies for Germany and also uh, integration policies for migrants arriving in the country. And this could spell a trouble and, indeed, conflict for Angela Merkel. Uh, Merkel really, at the moment, tries trying to uh, try and prevent any more disunity, not only within the German government, but also critically within her conservative bloc of the CDU and Seehofer's CSU party. So we see Merkel here really trying to paper over the the gaps and the cracks um, of, of, of issues between these leading parties. Um, but these are really short-term solutions. And we see the German Chancellor really on the back foot here. She's reacting to problems in the government rather than leading from the front. And I think that could spell trouble for her moving forward. Jessica Salt's live for us in Berlin. Thank you very much for that report.